this video, we'll be using the grid X to roll through the thoracic spine. To begin, we're going to divide the thoracic spine up into two zones. Zone one is simply from the bottom of the shoulder blades down to about the middle of the back, down a couple of inches. Zone two is going to be from the bottom of the shoulder blades up the thoracic spine to the top of the shoulder blades. So we will position here into that zone one. Our motions are going to be rolling through the area, followed by four cross frictions. I'm going to support my head here. Elbows are going to be out wide. A little bit of thoracic extension here. Raise the hips. I'm starting at the bottom of the shoulder blades coming up. And back down, there's one. Notice it's a small motion. Up and back for two. Breathing and relaxing. Three. Last one here, rolling my body up. Back down for four. After that fourth roll, set the hips on the ground. I'm right there at the bottom of the shoulder blades. Four cross frictions by going into a side crunch type of a motion. There's two. Be sure you're breathing. There's three. And four. Now to zone two. I'm right there at the beginning of zone two. Hips come up. Now I'm rolling my body down and up. There's one. Down and up for two. Down and up for three. Last one. Down and and up for four. Now I'm going to the top of that zone two, top of the shoulder blades, set the hips down, cross friction one, cross friction two, three, keeping a neutral spine, not going back too far, and four. Perfect job. That's how we would roll the thoracic spine. So keep in mind, two zones, four rolls, four cross frictions. Good job. Let's move on to the next.